They're not doing anything. Let's call them back. Okay. Who do you want to call them first? Um, I don't know. Why don't we call Max back? Yeah, you know what? I'm actually in a grocery store right now. Yeah, you know, for the price of bread. Um, the prices of wheat have gone up for that since 2006, 2007, you know, based off of uh, U.S. farmers' prices. At least it has gone up since the wheat prices. Um, during the 1950s, you know, a long time ago when the eggs were traded and bartered, you know, we don't do that here anymore. We just go about and um, they're at a fixed rate now. So, and meats? You talking about meats? Yeah. You know, it's come a long way now. They come in little packages. Prices of meat, depending on what kind of meat it is, you know, pork being 19%, uh, beef going up 50%, and uh, lamb and chicken coming up at 9%. You know, that's it's come a long way. Well, you know, being as, if, as we live in uh, Houston, the fifth largest city in uh, the United States, the price of living, the cost of living and everything has gone up 0.1% since uh, August. So, you know how that is, and it's just going to continue growing from there. Thanks again. You know. Thanks, man. Sure appreciate it. Sorry to call you back. Well, why don't we, uh, why don't we give Misty a call real quick and, and see if we can get that same information from man, her she, and she see better, how it compares. Man, she better not hang up on me. I'm going to be real upset. Let's, let's, let's try to call her Okay, back. okay. It was affecting my cost of living a lot. For groceries, milk, eggs, and bread, it comes in the form of a pill, which reduces the amount of groceries but increases the cost of food. And not only that, the price for one lithium ion battery cost us one million dollars. Thanks, Misty. Sure appreciate it. <laughs> I, don't even, I don't even want to say goodbye because she hung, hung, hung up on me the first time. But that little, that little Austin Powers thing, I was, I was kind of funny. Oh, definitely. Yeah. Um, so I guess next up on the list is Bubba. Yeah, yeah. I hope he's still not upset about the gas. I know, again. I know. Well, the first thing you know, hey, hey there, buddy. Yeah, well, yeah. How can, what can I do you for? It's on the cost of living. Oh, man, you asked the wrong guy today, man. I'm just up here at the grocery store trying to get some food, man. The crazy prices are crazy, man. I'm trying to get me one of these here. Six barrels ought to do me. They're going for 95 cents a barrel of hay. We used to go for 42 cents. We all thought it was good when minimum wage was went up from 30 cents to 75. But hell, bread has tripled from 8 cents to 16 to 28 in 1950. What am I going to do? How am I going to feed a family on that? It's great. Tristan, buddy, you still there? All right. You know, us country boys, we don't have any food processed. We get out straight from the ranch. You know, with the city being it's so advanced with all the technologies and whatnot, country slippers are getting left in the background. Look at this here. Chicken is costing me about a buck of chicken. Sir, do you know what this cost me 10 years ago? These chickens, one, two, and three are good. They cost me about 20 cents each. But with that inflation going up because the technology is advancing, us country boys are getting left behind, sir. What am I going to do? Thanks, Bob. Well, thanks for all this information. Man. Yeah, thanks Go again. Please. Sure appreciate it. Sorry to call you back. Right. Interesting. Definitely, definitely. Man, it's 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 amazing how how much things have changed during this time period yeah, that we're looking a at. Tremendous change from the gas prices to the cost of living right? to the different things that we actually use as food. Like you see how Bubba went to the chicken coop to go get him some chicken yeah. instead. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Max had his packaged up already and just just ready to serve me. I'm not telling what Bubba had to do with the chicken. Right. I don't really want to know. Right, me neither. So, and then to Misty with her pills of food, I can't, I can't even imagine <laughs> that one. Wow. Yeah, okay. Pill of food. How do you even get a <laughs> pill of food? Well, yeah, that's that's crazy. Well, well, man, this this should be great. This is really helpful, and you know, with what I've got, you know, from the textbook and mm -hmm. my, you know, online research. But then to have these firsthand interviews, that is just perfect. Man, this is gonna be the best. Best essay I've ever written. Yeah, <laughs> I've learned a ton today. Thanks. I sure appreciate it. No problem. But hey, uh, I got I to gotta go. I'm, oh, I'm I know. Man, I, I've taken up so much of your time. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. And that was just awesome. All right. Cool. Thank you so All much. Right. Talk to you later. Let me tell you about
that helps. And I, once again, I thank you for these uh, futuristic shoes. They're way more comfortable. I'm styling this profile. <laughs> Checking out the goats right quick. You know. What the heck? Woo! I'm gonna see this, but I don't do this country stuff. Goats stink. Now, this is the last one this is for Clint. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Boy, that's gonna be a transition. I said, no, man.